Two-time defending Caribbean motor racing champion Andrew King will make a return to Bushy Park Circuit for their international meet states for September 1. His iconic Mazda RX-7, which he has made his cherished toy on the track since 1998, has become extremely reliable, which has allowed his fans to see his silky smooth driving. It is an experience he is thoroughly enjoying. You may have noticed that over the last two years, um, the car has become a lot more reliable than it had been previously. Um, my take on motor racing now, as long as I'm able to, to compete and to complete races, and be competitive, um, I'm sort of happy. Um, the period of time when cars were breaking down and we were not able to complete races uh, was kind of depressing back then, but I'm enjoying my motorsport now. With an estimated lap time of one minute and multiple high-speed turns, Bushy Park is rated as one of the most challenging, and King is eager to return to succeed. Last year, he got a first and a third-place finish. Dover in Jamaica, I think, is the toughest track in the Caribbean. I've not raced at the other new circuit. Um, Barbados is very challenging. It's a lot more challenging than Ghana or even Trinidad. Um, I've had some good drives in Barbados. I've had periods where we didn't do that well, but um, overall it's a, it's a fun track and very challenging. So on a good day, you have your car set up properly and your car handles well, then I think you stand a good chance of doing well. He added his competitive drive makes him always want to win, but in the most fair fashion. Motor racing is always a challenge. Um, I'm a competitive type person going back to my days of athletics in school, uh, swimming, bit, I never did competitive cycling, but um, I tend to, to be competitive in whatever I do. So even though the car may not be up to speed, up to scratch, or as fast as another car, the challenge for me is to try to win at all costs. Um, all costs being relative, um, I mean, you don't do, go do craziness. Um, but the preparation of the vehicles back in my early days of racing used to be part of, big part of the challenge because back then, you know, spare parts were not as easily available as, as it is these days. And um, that was always a big challenge to get to work with what you have and um, try to make the best of that. And then on race day, you got to make up with your driving or your physical um, superiority, but not superiority, but your physical fitness, make sure that you're up to speed. Um, they, I know it's a lot of preparation now and a lot of the cars are a lot more technologically advanced, um, a lot more electronics involved, so people like myself kind of get left behind, so we have to depend on the younger technicians to do the tuning of the engines and all that, but we've got a good team. Um, my team has been together for a long time, and I, I trust their judgment and their um, dedication um, has kind of kept me in this sport. Racing since 1974, King just wants to enjoy the sport as long as he can, once he's healthy. As long as I'm physically able, um, it's, it's a break, it's, a, it's some time out for me from my regular schedule. Um, as long as I'm physically able, I will want to continue racing. Despite the disappointment of no Korean motor racing championships this year, he firmly believes all is not lost, since it can be suscitated in 2020, given the interest of a pool of committed drivers. For the newsroom, Akim Green.